Yo, what's up? This is Rockland. Today on Passport Kings, I'm going to go over the top six reasons why you should travel abroad for vacation or for good. Engage. I'm Rockland. I travel the globe for leisure, exploration, and education about different cultures. Join me, and you too can be royalty. This is Passport King. Welcome aboard, abroad. This channel was never created so I could have countdowns of women every week. Doing them is slowly starting to kill me on the inside. I guess that feeling comes from knowing that I was in some ways pandering and trying to recreate the magic that happened when I first made a pretty woman based countdown video. I have so many better ideas for this show and although the extra attention my channel was getting had its upsides, I know my writing and what I have to offer this world is a lot better than that. In my world, whenever it came to chasing women, it never mattered which country I was in, including the US. The best place to find what's missing with anyone's love life, sex life, or relationship life is usually staring back at that person in the mirror. Alright, so get those things like health, wealth, and social skills that be aggravating even you sorted out. And every Everything else about meeting others becomes easy, but I digress. Anyway, on this episode, let's say the divorce papers are final or your retirement has finally kicked in. Maybe you're a fresh graduate, fed up with American politics, or maybe you're thinking about research abroad. Maybe you're stuck in a dead-end job and are unsure of where to go next. Possibly you're waiting for one of those life events to begin, or perhaps you are ready to just drop it all and dive because you are starting to realize that that time of pure freedom will never come on its own and unforced. Either way, now you're looking to travel abroad or reside in another country. I'm here to tell you to take that opportunity and never look back. And no matter what happens, remember that the journey will be almost as fun as getting to your destination. As long as you have a passport and have been following the steps I've outlined in my free book called Make Money Online So You Can Travel More, you have the ability to change your entire life in an instant. I don't think it's a long shot. Many people have packed up and left and you will not be the first or last to do it. Of course, there will be a plethora of obstacles that will try to hinder you from visiting or moving abroad, but I suggest you pick up a Passport King shirt and consider these six main reasons why you should travel overseas. Number six, new experiences. Studies have shown that people live happier lives when they spend their money on adventures that create lasting memories rather than on material things. Wouldn't you rather spend $100 to go cliff diving in Costa Rica than on a new pair of Jordans or the 55th update of the same iPhone? Investing in new experiences will undoubtedly create a unique memory that will never be outdone by looking at the new TV and watching shows of actors living out their dreams of becoming actors or being the audience that a writer always dreamed would listen to their writings. Home entertainment is indeed worth something, I guess, but while you're home, you're missing out on the real world. Number five, culture. By traveling, you get to learn about different cultures firsthand. While you can always read a book about gangs out China, there is something special about touching the brand new fabric from their factories or tasting blowfish for the first time from an authentic Asian cook. As soon as you experience cultural distinctions firsthand, you can begin to understand why people do what they do and why they do it the way they do it. Number four, adventure. Memories at your back and the unknown in your eyesight does all, at least I, ever wanted in life. Dragging a suitcase through an airport may take away some of the thrill, but the knowledge that I'm going to see something I've never seen before makes up for it. The adventuring options are endless, and you can travel to the Amazon in South America, check out the Northern Lights in Iceland, or visit Luxor temples in Egypt. Sitting at home watching these on TV or on YouTube is like trying to enjoy a slice of cake by looking at pictures of it in a magazine. Number three, getting terminology correct. Along with understanding a culture's traditions and foods, you can also finally get their language down pat. After trying to talk a new language and constantly getting laughed at by what you said, it could get a little frustrating, although cute at first. It's something to blush at when at a party with a nice young lady and trying to have swag. But if you are somewhere and need something important urgently, there's nothing like using the correct syntax to get your needs met. Syntax is the position of words, and saying the dog bit Mike may be using the same exact words as the sentence, Mike bit the dog. <laughs> but being out of syntax could mean a very big difference in the response you get. Go get familiar and enjoy learning. Number two, opportunity and connection. 
If you move abroad, you will not be stuck at that telemarketing job you've been afraid to quit for the last two years. Instead, work anywhere you want. You may get a job teaching English at an elementary school, or maybe you earn your keep being an au pair and traveling the world as a nanny. The point is, you now have the opportunity and freedom to do what you always wanted to try. Use your degree or not, it's up to you. Maybe you have always wanted to be a poet, a musician, a photographer. With the internet, almost any creative profession can now be done from home or on the go on your laptop. Find a way to automate or freelance out your expertise so you can spend more time at a coffee shop on the laptop smiling at potential new best friends and associates. Number one, become a new and better you. Going abroad allows you to make new friends and connections. You will no longer be seen as the guy who was married to a certain woman or the old reliable helper that never expected anything in return. You can start from scratch and be who you always wanted to be. Demand new respect from everyone you meet and make sure you never fall in the same traps of being too nice again. Only meet and hang out with people who love the same hobbies and passions as you do. Imagine the pleasure you would have right now if you could call your best friend and talk about what's exactly on your mind in detail and that person understand all the nuances of your issue. While you will inevitably miss your family and friends when you're abroad, you will be busy creating new memories new friends and maybe even new family if and when you come back just knowing about the position you have placed yourself in in your life abroad will give you the confidence and evidence you needed to demand experiences that are aligned with your expectations of how others see you and treat you hey if you have the tiniest urge to go live in a foreign country i encourage you to look into how you can make it a reality at least for a little while test the water your walk into the unknown will teach you invaluable things about yourself grow you into a more responsible and mature person and undeniably create some priceless memories you will be challenged to reevaluate your own values and cultural norms. And when you come back home, if you come back home, your perspective on the world will be adjusted into a new reality. Never get stuck in one country for the rest of your life. There's a lot of places to see and a lot of things to do. And when you travel a lot, you become informed. So stay informed like a king, a passport king. like this episode great remember to leave comments below subscribe and like and share it with your social media follow me on facebook twitter and instagram and if you want to make money online or just book a trip go to www.passportkings.com and pick up our free book while you're there